We talked about this man being able to fly. What a moment to do it in. Big air. Remember this day, June 5th, 2021. This is the day that history is made here at the Surf City El Salvador ISA World Surfing Games. We filled the final seven spots for women in the Olympics and four of five of the men's spots filled from this beach. History was made right here. This is Spencer, have a look at the size of that wave. Beautiful. Fast surfing right there. That is like really, really solid. This is the first round of the event. With Olympic qualification implications, the top two surfers book their tickets to Tokyo. Driving into that first turn, nice big swooping car. Nice tight finish. Take a look at this first wave from Yolanda. Look at that first big opening turn. That's it, the Portuguese duo of Teresa Bonvelo and Yolanda Sequeira have earned their slots. It feels amazing, two first spots taken to Portugal. It's an amazing feeling and I'm super happy and I mean Portugal is dripping and let's go and I'm super stoked for Tokyo. Leilani, good turn right there from McGonagall. Great snap to start off with from the Olympian. Costa Rica's Leilani McGonigal and Peru's Daniela Rosas have done it. They are headed to Tokyo 2020. Now we go to the women's rapid charge rounds to make more Olympic dreams come true. In women's rapid charge round eight, Japan's Amuro Tazuki, Mahina Maeda, and Francis Pauline Addo have secured the final women's slot for Tokyo 2020. The qualification scenarios led to the reallocation of provisional slots qualifying Peru's Sofia Milanovic and Ecuador's Dominic Barona. The men's rapid charge rounds will now determine which men will represent their countries in Tokyo. By advancing through his heat, Leon Glatzer becomes the sole Olympic surfer from Germany. At the moment, it's, it's kind of unreal still. I think it, it has to sink in definitely, but man, we put in so much work with the whole German team. We're a crew of 10 here and we're giving our 100% every day. And yeah, I think I'm off the moon. I, I still doesn't feel real yet, but, but it looks like it is. So I'm really happy that this happened. Now the top two of the second heat will earn their slots and the third place finishers will go to the tie break with their heat totals. As he speeds down the line, goes to the air. Can he come down with it? The Peruvians, Miguel Tudela and Luca Messinas, finish one and two to solidify their slots. Indonesia's Ketuda Goose falls on the final wave, giving the tiebreak spot to Chile's Manuel Selman. The men's qualification slots led to the reallocated slots for Argentina's Leandro Suna and Indonesia's Rio Waida. The battle for the final Olympic slot carries over to tomorrow as Japan's Hiroto Ohara and Shun Murakami will face off to determine who competes in Tokyo 2020. Tomorrow will be another epic day of surfing, the final day here at the Surf City ISA World Surfing Games live from El Salvador. We'll see you then. Yeah!